have I got a message for you. Yes, you. It's Friday. Let's go. What's up, beautiful people? Woo! <laughs> yeah, it's a beautiful Friday. What's going on, people? Fun Friday? Are you feeling it? Feel it Friday? But that's not my dub of the day, but I got a great message for you today. Listen, September 1st was Wednesday, right? First of all, man, it's so beautiful outside. Get outside, get you some sunlight. I hope it's beautiful where you are. Blessing to everybody that's been affected by Hurricane Ida. I hope that if you had damage, the recovery process is well on its way. But it's a beautiful day, and we're blessed to be here. If you see, if you see me, you're blessed. So listen, I want to do a dub of the day, and this one is perfect because I guess September 1st was the official calendar first day of autumn. So my dub of the day is Fall Friday. Fall Friday. Woo! Fall Friday. Listen, I want you to fall away from all those bad habits and fall into good habits. I want you to fall into the best version of yourself. I want you to fall into that commitment for consistency. I want you to fall out of love with that self-doubt. I want you to fall out of love with that imposter syndrome that's telling you, despite all the success that you've seen, that you've accomplished this year, this day, this month, that, oh my God, do I deserve it? Is it real? Can I do this? Listen, I want you to fall out of that and fall into the greatness that you are. I want you to fall into your power. That's what I want you to do. Fall into the new you. It's been a tough year for some. It's been a tough month for some. It's been a tough week for some, but it's Friday. You've made it. So as I always say, have some fun. Celebrate the small things. A lot of times we think about the larger goals. I was in a session uh, this week with a client and we were discussing how we look at these end goals, the big goal, right? But we don't take time to break that down into small chunks so we can celebrate and check off. It's something about when you check something off your list that gives you a little bit more fuel to do more. Is that just me? That's you too? Okay. Gives you fuel. So fall into the habit of writing things down so you can chart your progress, so you can chart your wins, so you can champion yourself fall into the idea that there is no one that can stop you but you. You are your only competition. And I wrote a blog a while back that told you what to tell your competition. Tell your competition to shut the hell up because you are the greatest. You are the best. Fall into that idea. Fall into your best self and bring it to now and go get it, people. You got this. Listen, it's Friday. I'm about to have a great Friday, a great weekend. I hope that you all do the same. Here we go. Murphy's Law. You are somebody. Today you are great. Tomorrow you'll be greater because Ms. Murphy said so and I concur. My three W's. Note that the universe will, the universe is aligned to give you what you want, will, and work for in that order. My five P's, baby. Let your power give you a passion that will pin you to your purpose. And once you plan properly, experience prosperity. That is spiritually, mentally, socially, physically, and financially. And know that you can do that. Know that you can fall into your best self. Know that you can fall into the commitment to consistency. Know that you can fall into getting out of the habit of doubting yourself. Know that you can fall into grace, to forward momentum. Why? Why can you do that? Because you are the five C's, baby. You are capable, competent, confident, conscious, and courageous mm, to do any and everything that you seek to do in this life and the next. So get up, get out, get something, people. As always, you already know that God loves you, so do I. And I want you to love life, live love, peace, together, not apart. Y'all take care.